Recently I've been trying to take my music compositions in new directions. Along this journey I've decided to build some synthesizers I couldn't really justify the purchase price of. The most recent of these was a clone of the EMS Synthy VCS3. I'm now taking on a new project, which is to build a clone of the Buchler 208 Stored Program Sound Source Module. The 208 forms one of the major components of the Buchler Music Easel. If you search YouTube, you can find many great examples of the versatility of this instrument. I was lucky enough to find two different sellers on the web. One that could sell me the faceplate and one that had already reverse engineered the printed circuit boards. They were both quite expensive, but with the amount of work undertaken, I thought the price was reasonable. The module boards, when they arrived, were all still connected together on two larger PCBs, so task one was to split these up. Even though the boards were scored to allow them to be broken apart, I wanted to be 100% sure that nothing would get damaged. Some of the circuit traces were very close to the edge of the boards. I was concerned if they snapped or if they flexed a little too much, it could cause some significant rework repairing these or spending a lot of time later down the line tracing faults. Being excited to get started, I decided to use a Stanley knife blade to further score the boards, just to be sure. Originally, I was going to use the blade in the holder, but I got a bit concerned that I could run outside the score lines, maybe not see it, or inadvertently damage one of the traces. So, very carefully, OCK health and safety issues aside, I decided to use the naked blade on the boards. As you can see, uh, once scored, the boards broke apart quite easily and without too much flexing. Now that the boards are split up, it's time to go to the web and start ordering some of the other components. Once they arrive, I'll update you with the next video. Thanks for watching.